Yes, what's good everybody? Quick ship vid. Hey, I don't know. So obviously weekend, Saturday, shit. Um, wasn't the most entertaining game ever. I thought, to be fair, I thought, well, I don't think the game was particularly unentertaining. It just obviously the result was awful. Just didn't take his chances. Um, I thought James had a couple of chances, didn't he? The first one were a really good save, to be fair. The one in the second half where it were like, well, keeper sort of stranded and then he just sort of miss it, didn't he? On volley, sort of snatched at it a little bit. I think if we'd have had Bamford in, um, I think we'd have, we'd have done them, to be honest, in that first half. I thought we were really, really quite good and I thought the game were quite good, quite open. Newcastle looked to upset it a little bit, didn't they? But also, in fairness to them, did whatever they had to, didn't they, to get the results, so, you know... Uh, Meslier is getting a bit of shit for goal, but I'm not in on that. I think, you know, probably should have done better with it, but I think for every game that he's kept us in or, you know, massive important saves, even at 0 0 and stuff, he's. I'm going to give him that 100%. You know, I don't think that's an. It's not an error. It, well, it's not a, a major error. It's a. These things happen, don't they? If he's tried to take a touch on ball and it's gone under his foot, so like, that's a total fuck up in it. But. So, yeah, half and half. But yeah, didn't didn't mind first half. Always concerns me when we're that on top though, and then we don't sort of take our chances. When Click came off, there's a few people saying that he were kicking off, but because he were booting shit about wanting, they were saying you know commentators sort of alluded to the fact that he was he was angry about being brought off, which I don't think that's the case. I think he was more frustrated about the game. Seems like a decent individual, don't he, Clicky? I love him, but I don't think I think that's bollocks. He was just you know. I, Frustrated with the game. Obviously, Walter wanted to come off, but I don't think he's, I don't think he's spat dummy out. Uh, apparently, Bamford's not not guaranteed to be back before uh, for Villa game on 9th of Feb. That's our next game, international break, isn't it now? Um, Bamford not being back is just fucking horrible. It's been horrible all season. Everybody that was fucking slagging it last year, it's like you got what you deserve now because we've been without him all season, haven't we? Really, and you know we're lacking some. Bite upstairs, aren't we? But yeah, so toothless up top, as we were saying the other day. That's what it is when we've not got Bamford about. Uh, I thought Geldart should have come on before Roberts, before anybody goes wild about that, but I don't think Roberts is the reason why we lost that game. I'll just leave it at that. So yeah, international break, 9th of February, we're back against Villa, which I'm hoping we do. Villa Villa are in pretty decent form under Gerard, aren't they? But uh, yeah. Bit of shit talk, some transfer talk. Uh, just quickly on Rafinha, still no on his contract. Danny Mills has piped up saying that if he's if they're in a release clause in his contract, he needs to sack his agent and all this shit like that. I wish Danny Mills would just get back under rock where he left, to be honest, because where he came from, I can't I can't stand him. He's a dickhead. Um, but yeah, some shit talk. So that Nawa Lang, which I can't say his name, he's, I can't be asked mentioning him. He's been. I'm sick of talking about him. It's been past. Ever since I started this channel, we've been yapping on about him. So, but apparently he's expressed that he wants to leave and all this nonsense. So, but if that any more of that materialises, I'll talk about that more. Um, Brendan Aronson is apparently off. Apparently they have got a twenty million pound reject bid rejected for him, and uh, that Salzburg lad, Red Bull Salzburg, and apparently he doesn't. The the club aren't willing to negotiate anymore. So. Allegedly, we've moved on to a lad called Fabio Carvalho who plays for Fulham. Um, he's only 19 years old. He's got six months left on his contract. They're on about five million for him. Uh, and then there's a lad called Jason Knight who plays for Derby. 20, 20 years old, but apparently he doesn't want to leave. And apparently Everton are linked with him as well. Uh, but yeah, he's, he's apparently enjoying, li enjoying life under Rooney, which I can only imagine why you wouldn't. I certainly would not. Um, yeah, there's a, a defensive midfielder that plays for Marseille as well that Man U are apparently favourites for. He's 22 years old. He's only got six months left on his contract as well. Um, I forgot his name, which is a bit insane. But yeah, um, yeah, Villa are after him apparently. Man U at favourites. 22 years old. I'm going to have to look it up. DMC is so be sort of like... Um, 
a replacement for Phillips, one that you would imagine. Oh yeah, Babacar Kamara. So, but apparently, you know, he plays a lot of games for Marseille and stuff. So it's apparently really important to him. So, yeah. What do you reckon? I'm hoping Raf gets his contract signed, and there will be a release clause in it, and it doesn't guarantee that he doesn't leave at end of season, like I said. Other day. That's my ship vid. I just want to do a quick shout out to the legend that I legend that I met on Saturday night. We're out all pissed up in Rogers and this lad came over to me. He's called Ricky Roy. I've got a photo with him and that. Appreciate you, man. Cheers for tuning in. And that's the attitude, lad. When uh, if you see me, shout me, because it's funny, and we'll get a photo. Nice one. If you want to support me, I've got my membership channel below. 99p a month helps me put these shit vids together. Um, if you want to follow my music, I'm going to be bringing out loads this month, this year rather. I'll be doing weekly videos, freestyles, everything. I'm going to start a podcast, all that stuff. So, yes, click the links below, subscribe, like, comment, all that shite. See you in a bit. Surprises why I asked.